Hey guys, I'm back. Back. <laughs> um, yeah, so happy Easter. This is my spring break, so I'm finally able to make a video and kind of check in with everybody. It's been a really long time. I think I haven't filmed in like um, three weeks or something like that. Um, yeah, just super busy with school and everything. So I want to get back into my swing. I think I have a nice little schedule, or I did for a while, where I would make two videos every two weeks. Um, and that kind of worked for me. Um, so hopefully I can get back to that. And I'll film two today, and then, you know, every two weeks, you get two new videos for me at the same time. Um, but I looked at my calendar, and it's a, f a few things have happened that are really cool. <clears throat> but this is my actual year anniversary of being on YouTube. One year, woo! So, yeah, I mean, it's it's been a full year of making videos, and I remember my first video that's on here. It's, um, I think it was a skit I did, um, and now I've kind of transitioned to doing, you know, the psychology videos, and you know, a lot of shit has happened. Um, I've gotten my first hater. Uh, I've gotten, you know, um, I stopped planning videos. Like, I used to write scripts and kind of, like, do that sort of thing. But now I kind of just make videos and, you know, go off the top of my head, which is fun. And I think I've made that, that kind of transition. I still... As a year goal, I want to make another channel, like a second channel, where I can kind of do more experimental things and then have this be just like psychology and just talking about social sciences and social behavior because that's something that's like a hobby of mine. I'm a hobbyist and I have so much more information in my head. Um, so what are some things that have changed in a year? Within a year... A year is a long time, so when I started the year, I thought I was an INFJ, and then I found out for certain, because of, um, you know, researching cognitive functions, that I am an INTJ, um, and I started to really look into cognitive functions, and I have a really good um, understanding of it, where I can, you know, talk about them out of context, and kind of make my own context, and I understand them concept conceptually. So that's been good, cool. Um, someone's made three videos. I've had three videos made um, about me. And um, I'm in my master's and I'm six months into my master's and I'll have my master's in October. So look at what a difference a year makes. I um, got my YouTube award, the Build Your Channel Award within this year which was really fun and nice. And um, yeah, I'm going to continue on my path of YouTube. I will say that my goals with this channel has changed just because I've seen all sorts of shit. Like, I've seen that in general, a lot of reductive clickbait videos like get the most views and shit. Um, I've seen people flat out lie and, you know, become viral hits and everything. And... In general, I think that if you're looking at this and you're thinking about starting a YouTube, I would very much advise making a very specialized thing, like make it just about one thing, because then you'll get a consistent audience. And I would suggest that for anything, like if you want to make money off of YouTube, Twitter, Instagram or anything, don't have it be kind of all across the board. Like, have it be about one specific thing. So that's something I want to do. So something that you might see this year for me are, you know, very specialized channels where, like, um, I do very specific things. Um, and I just want to thank you guys for watching. This is going to be a short video, but thank you guys for watching and following me in my journey, seeing me now as a student, um, seeing my development and understanding of Myers-Briggs and just myself and you know, my personality on YouTube. So I'm not looking at this channel as a channel to make money anymore. And I think that's changed it a lot. So I feel a lot less pressure. I was thinking about making money on it, but I don't feel like that's something I'm going to be able to do on this channel. I would only be able to do it in very uh, niche sort of channels. So that's something that I'm thinking about. 
in addition to still, you know, making videos here. So one year down and I can't wait to see you guys for the next year. Stick with me, talk to me, sing with me, watch me, love me. And until next time, love you bunnies. Bye. Oh, I just want to add one more thing. I was thinking about it like I'm on my way out. Um, I will be starting a MBTI blog. Um, and also I wanted to say that in the coming year, obviously. So look out for that and I'll, I'll keep you guys updated about the blog. And I also wanted to add that uh, most people do not last a year on YouTube. Most people get extremely disillusioned and um, they stop making videos completely or they post erratically. Um, not erratically like me, like, you know, every two weeks or once a month, but like, you know, twice a year or something. Um, so they get disillusioned. And once again, you know, so I, I kind of beat that because I do intend to use this as my video blog and my video diary. And that's its first and foremost thing in my life. Hold on. Sorry.